In Washington, all eyes are on special counsel Jack Smith, who may be moving closer to another indictment towards former President Donald Trump, this time for his alleged efforts to overturn the 2020 election. It is a topic that has consumed the political world and really the race for the Republican nomination, with new polling showing, as you heard, Mr. Trump is still holding a big lead nationally, especially in key states like we saw in South Carolina. NBC has the latest for us. As the investigation into Donald Trump intensifies this week, the former president firing away on social media at the prosecutors who may soon indict him on a second round of federal charges as they look into efforts to overturn the 2020 election. Getting indicted and arrested by sick government thugs would be my great honor. Mr. Trump calling prosecutors campaign managers for President Biden while accusing them of trying to, quote, steal another election, even as their investigation continues. A grand jury in the nation's capital hearing evidence from former Trump White House aide Will Russell last week about the former president's state of mind around the election, according to a source familiar with his testimony. The potential charges against the former president have become a topic of debate among his primary opponents. The president lied to them and told them the election was stolen. I'd rather that these issues and the judgment about his conduct on January 6th be, be left to the American people in the upcoming uh, primaries. While Mr. Trump is the current frontrunner, his legal calendar appears set to collide with the 2024 political calendar. A federal judge in Florida on Friday said a mid-May start date for Mr. Trump's trial on charges he mishandled classified documents and obstructed the government's efforts to retrieve them. That will follow a March start date for the New York trial on charges related to alleged hush money payments to Stormy Daniels. Mr. Trump has pleaded not guilty in both cases. And recent polling shows that Trump's greatest Republican opponent, at least right now, is Florida Governor Ron DeSantis, who is losing support fast while the former president is steadily gaining ground.